Oh, there we go. <laughs> I think my mic's working now. Good morning, everyone. I'm I'm doing just a, a quick video. I, everybody is still seems to have a lot of concern and, and issue with with getting an add-ons installed. What have we got going here? And uh, so I wanted to show the quick an easy way for for first to find your community folder uh you know the, depending on your install it can be in a lot of places and uh, the definitive and correct way to find it i believe I, I could be wrong is you go right here and you turn on your general uh your your developer mode in your general settings that gives you this toolbar that's all we need and then we'll go up here to tools, uh, virtual file system. Yeah. Packages and folders. And there it is. Open that. And there's your community folder. And and this will be different. Don't read my, uh, you know, the, this address is not going to be the same. That's why I'm saying don't, don't go by anybody telling you to look here in this address, look there in the address. This button will open the file that the the folder that the game is going to look for for add-ons, and that gives you the right folder. Once you get here, use this little arrow. Now you're you're you, you may look like this, and that little arrow is way up here. But either way, use this little arrow once. Go up here. Right click on your community folder. Right click, and then send to desktop to create shortcut. Now, is what that'll do is it'll save you from having to go into the game. Now you'll have a shortcut. It'll take you right there. I already have one down here, so it's named two. All right, and then you're gonna get an add-on. Now this is what I I built, and it's actually on Flight Sim To. It's a livery for the X Cup, and uh, I'll show you how to move that to your to your uh, game. I'm going to go ahead and exit the game because uh, you have to uh, restart the game for it to see add-ons. So now that we have this uh, shortcut, we know where to put this add-on. It's a zip file. This is not a folder. If you copy that directly in there, nothing's going to happen. Okay, we need folders. So Windows actually works with zip files just like folders. So you can open that, that uh, add-on. And the important thing here is we're looking for the two control files. Well, in my add-on, they're one, one folder deep. Those two, you may or may not see the .json, depending on your Windows settings. But you'll see Layout and Manifest, and they'll probably look like a blank file, like, well, I don't have any here, <laughs> but they'll probably not look like I, I have mine associated edited with a notepad, so I can just double click and open them. Yours probably won't be, so they'll just be a blank white looking file. But this is the folder that has to go in there. So we'll copy that, right click, copy, and open the shortcut we just created. Right click again and paste. You can do it. You can do the same thing with these, you know, copy and pastes here. Okay, a community, add-on folder, layout manifest, layout and manifest. I know I'm right. If this has an extra, in other words, this will work. But if I were to say 7-zip or regular zip, doesn't matter. Say I extract this and see how there's an extra folder here. If I were to move this folder into the into the directory it won't work this won't work because if i open it here these control files are not where they need to be they have to be one directory under community this one is correct this one is wrong and won't work so we'll get rid of that but that's it uh, the big thing is finding the right community and getting this folder in there in the right folder order. 
the, these two files right there have to be only one directory below community. And that'll work every time. And I'll boot the game back up and show you the livery, but that's basically all there is to it. Uh, the big thing people have is, is one, they extract the folders wrong and they get the, those control files too deep in the directory structure. And of course the game can't load them. Or they're working in one of the com default community folders. As well, the problem is they have so many different installation uh, setups for this game that they create at least two that I know of, community folders that may not be used, but they have to create them to install the game. And then during the installation of the game, you can choose, you can even then create a third place that they, that the game may use for, for your packages. And, and just some uh, notes on how add-ons work. The entire game works just like add-ons. The uh, the entirety of the official packet official folder are packages, just like we create add-ons, and it loads just like we load our add-ons. It loads first, and it loads into a VFD, a virtual file system, and then our add-ons load on top of that. That allows us to override or edit files in that virtual file system without overriding the files on the hard drive but it, it does create some confusion. But yeah, you just you have to look and find those two files because I mean different people package their their add-ons slightly different, and they may be in a different folder structure in that zip file, and you have to find the right folder that you want to move. Uh, what am I looking for? Oh, actually, I just need to show the hanger and show that it uh, installed here. My Xcub. See if it installed. Yep, and there's my library. So that that's that's the correct way. Uh, you know, you can look through the files for different folders, but even then, if you find the folder, a community folder, you're not guaranteed it's the right folder. So you're gonna wanna you're gonna wanna make sure you're in the right community folder first, which that you do from the tools menu, virtual file system, package folders, and open that. And there's my add-on. And then open that, and there's these two manifests. If you have to open any extra folders to find these two files, then it's wrong. The add-on won't work. It has to be one folder below this. And like I said, this C, that's a custom install. Your community folder will not be in the same location. Don't create one there. It won't work. <laughs> the only folder that's going to load uh, add-ons is the one the game opens right here. Any other folder won't load them add-ons. It's not uh, random community folders. It's a specific one. Anyway, uh, that's pretty much it. Uh, I just wanted to do a, a short video on how to find the community folder correctly and and definitively, because that's a big issue people seem to keep having. And the other is those two files. They, they just want to unzip that add-on in there, and they don't pay attention to the folder structure so that those files get too far down in the in the directory structure in the game. Actually, I should show that, but the game will actually show it as uninstalled in the con content manager. 
it, it knows there's an add-on there, but it can't load it because the files aren't the right right place. So, you know, you, you have to be careful, even if it's shown in the add-on category in the community content folder, which I can show. If it's correctly installed, it'll show... How do we find this? Okay. Yeah, it'll show in here, instead of installed, it'll show uninstalled. And it may not even show community. It probably won't. But this is what it should look like installed. Now, mine shows all this stuff. It may not have all that. It may have a default picture. But you should see it in there when it's installed. All right. Uh, well, I hope that helps some people. And uh, y'all have a wonderful day. And I'll talk to you soon. Oh, I stopped this. Anyway.